In Kobolds and Catacombs, we were introduced to the legendary weapon. Some of them were good, some of them were bad, but I wanted to see if it was still possible to win a game with every single one while making sure they're the reason why I win. Let's see if it's possible. This is going to be horrendous. The first weapon I decided to do was Kingsbane. Kingsbane was pretty great in its time in Standard and definitely saw some play in Wild. Even though right now it isn't a super meta weapon, I figured this would be a pretty great start to the challenge. I'm kind of for this one. This should be fine. We don't want patches. I guess I'll keep Buccaneer. Hmm. I like Buccaneer because it pulls out the patches. We just basically, maybe I should put two of those guys who draw weapons. There's two of them in here, right? Perfect. That's actually insane. Awesome. Oh, he's a run with all deck. I mean, there's infinite. Oh, it's quest deck. Okay. This might be really hard. Oh, maybe we can first try this and get it out of the way. Okay, never clear it. You never clear it. They never clear it. Like, we're going to draw King's Bing now. We're going to coin it out because we have this. We go face. We go face. And I guess we swing. No attack with patches. Oh, you haven't been here for a while, dude. He doesn't have charge anymore. Oh, OK. OK. That's really good. Too. Wow. Insane. OK, this is. Oh, it's so much draw. Passage is great. For the record, if I knew that this was going to be my next card, I wouldn't have played the, the second cutting class because then I would have got the proc. Yeah, we're doing a lot of damage already, though. This is, this is good. Probably just fine. I don't really need the dagger point, right? I don't need the damage, uh, the attack on the minion, sorry. This is going well. Hopefully, we can just win the game. I would be very thankful to get the first game out of the way very fast. Oh, my God. Hello there, beautiful. Welcome back. I missed you so much. All right, we're obviously doing this. I guess we'll just do this because we have it. I guess I could play this. They might just kill it, but it's something on board at least. They're technically dead in two turns, right? I want to do a video that's like winning with like the craziest win conditions in Hearthstone, but I don't know what to call it. Oh. All right. Anyways, thanks for watching. That's going to be the end of the stream. Oh, I'll, I'll catch you guys some other time. That sucked. <laughs> I didn't even think about the teching against these weapons. I'm so F. Unlike the other challenges I have done, this is the first real time where the strategy of each deck can be countered by just putting in a card that destroys weapons. This actually made my life a whole lot harder. Now, this is going to be grueling experience. I want to do this if I'm being honest. Gross, but it is what it is. OK, brutal. I might just uh, play flurry, to be honest. I just take too much damage, so I just have to hope I draw it. Oh, <gasps> wow. Insane. Okay, there's no point to do this. I, I'm. Ah, I didn't think King's Bane was going to take me nearly as long already. And uh, if I'm going to be honest, we're looking rough. Cavern Shiny Fine is great. Buccaneer is great. Red Chris here is great. Deadly Poison is great. This is a great hand. Okay, so it's uh this, this. Would I rather get two damage now or later? I think I just want to play them. Sean. I just basically have to hope that they don't have weapon tech because uh, if they have weapon tech, it's going to really suck. I guess I just play this. It's not like I really need the damage. Maybe it's fine. I'll just but I might try the, the, the League of Legends MMO when it comes in. I guess we do this, but I can also do this first because it doesn't change. Okay. Poison. I actually really like raiding party, but I don't think we need to actually get it, right? Yeah, so that's what I was waiting for to use this. So all right, I think it's lethal next turn. Is that it? Is that game? All right. I don't know what I would just went against. I don't know what this quite. Oh, that's really spooky. Actually, he did play a Cantor's flow, so I'm going to be very glad to murder this dude right here. But it's pretty safe to say here that Kingsbane ended up winning us this game. So we can move on. Thank God it didn't take me that long. The next weapon we're going to do is the Woe Cleaver for Warrior. And the basic idea of the Woe Cleaver is to play it in a big deck and summon big minions from your deck to hopefully win you a game of Hearthstone. This weapon was not considered great, so I was expecting this to take me a while. I mean, I'm going to send two from the depths and just hope for the best. OK, so this is whoa. I mean, I'm good for commencement as long as we find coarser cash or from the depths. Maybe could be sick. Well, there she is. So we can go commencement into Woke Cleaver and potentially that's enough, depending on what mage deck this is, though. Honestly, it could be worse. I wonder if I just do this. It gives me two armor back. It might be relevant for this. I'm not sure. I think I can't actually beat this deck if I'm going to be honest. This is going to seem cringe, but I'm going to do it. I get in uh, barb. Well, I mean, OK, well, he, they did it, so I guess that's something. It's three mana, that's four mana, five mana or sorry, not five mana. What is that? Eight. OK, <laughs> that didn't seem great, dude. I'm going to be honest. Nice, huge, actually. OK, maybe we could win. Play the top deck one because we're, we're five. OK, Wait, Grom is huge. OK. Wait a minute. Hold on. They're kind of tossing it. Uh, OK, that hits my Grom, unfortunately. It's my Grom, unfortunately. But again, this is possible actually to, to win a case because now we woke Cleaver and we just get big minions on the board because we hit this. 
Troublemaker's great. Don't trade in. Go face, please. Nice. Go face again. Nice. They don't have another rune of the Archmage. If they have another parrot, dude, it could be bad. I think you can count this that the Woke Cleaver won us the game. How do you deal with your emotion because you're a six-year-old? Ah, one day at a time, man. Excellent gaming from that individual right there. Okay, well, I'm gonna trade here first, just in case that this is the, uh, I guess it's not. What is this? I wonder if it's ever mere entity. If it's mere entity, it's gonna suck, but it's never mere entity, right? Full minion. Ooh, and that's rag. Going into this, I think. Well, that actually sucks, but at least rag can um, get face here. Nice. They could play two dudes and kill my whole board, but I mean, ugh, that's actually really unfortunate. So we have Deathwing, the Lich King, Nepshalon. Like this is what I didn't want, and now they get to do it, and I look like an absolute idiot. But I mean, I guess it could be worse if I'm being honest. Is there any card in my deck that actually wins me the game? I want like Lich King here, possibly. All twelve is fine. I'm gonna play this, I think, because it's just more damage. All right, chat, let me ask you a question. Do you guys think that this was enough of a game for the Woke Cleaver to win? I think it would be. I think the Woke Cleaver did the job. <laughs> Yo, why so many secrets? Bro, if it's gonna be Ice Block, I'm gonna cry. I think that was it. All right, I'm pretty stoked. One game for that. Next was the Druid Legendary, Quig of the World Tree. And this weapon was good in Standard, and it is currently being used in Wild. So I didn't expect this one to take that long. Turns out gaining 10 mana crystals is a pretty powerful effect. So I'll keep Ferocious Hal, I'll toss everything else back. We're looking for the Twig, obviously. So Shutterwalk might be an issue, because I don't know if I actually have enough damage. Okay, they do run the Rothschild Trap Viper. Not that that really matters. Oh, Shutterwalk, right? Ah, greeting. Twig of the World Tree. How are we? There is a potential with the twig that I can go for like two Cthulhu's in one turn. I'm not really sure if this is correct, but I mean, getting the mana down earlier seems good. Okay, we're copying another Serenite Chain Gang. Man, this is gonna go beautifully into my heart. Okay. I mean, this is hot, so. All right, I guess we can draw. I don't think armor is very relevant. Is this the Maw? This is definitely like Shutterwalk, so I gotta be able to kill him at some point. Ah, see, I don't wanna see that. It's kind of annoying. I could just use Biology Project here and just draw a couple cards. I don't really, I think the Maw is probably okay with this though, right? I'll also just use Scales, but I'm not sure if that's actually good. Okay, we'll do this, we'll do this. I think doing two Cthulhu's in a turn would be like insane. But at some point, they might just play Shutterwalk and we die. Oh my God. Bro, stop with the armor. What did I just watch? Really? You had the Viper, but you didn't use it. Interesting. I don't know what I'm watching. Munus double E next turn, is it? I mean, if he has Munus, he has Munus, right? It's hard to play around it. Wait, are we leaving this up? Are you leaving Vargoth up? I don't understand what's ha- What is going on? All right, so they get spell for each one? Oh, they're not frozen anymore. Hmm. Like, I, I don't want to Moonlight because I feel like I'm going to need Cthune. But at the same time, it's like, if I don't Moonlight, I'm probably dead. And if they go Munus here, I'm probably dead. Oh my God, stop. How did you get a third? one but he grumbled it he grumbled it I, can see. I forgot augers boom oh i just basically have to hope my opponent doesn't do anything we're going against boar breeze okay very goth every time that's not hard am i gonna get bored if i play the twig first that means i get mana the following turn oh god oh my god i'm a bit spooked so because we could do this into this get some cards of our hand go face we find two like we need to find asap i still have to play Cthune, dude this guy's just going sick little mode on me i guess this case i'm gonna try to find twig i like ferocious hell though it's so much draw i need to find the twig like the, none of this matters am i dead okay oh my god hey this is actually so important to draw i can't even explain it if i could find sphere because sphere's one mana i know what you guys you're thinking you're like oh my god how is he gonna actually win with the weapon uh, normally it was gonna be a cthulhu win condition but if they get the weapon here which i believe they will right you're so you're salty after this one dog oh my god no way wait this is it wait can i kill him i have to be able to kill him if i can't kill him here we're in a bad spot he's dead he's actually dead right we do this we do this we do this we do this and they're dead Listen, it wasn't the wind condition that I wanted, but it's the wind condition that we got. After your hero attacks, discover a spell and cast with a random target. I never thought in my life I would craft this card, but here we are. The next weapon was the Shaman Legendary, the Rune Spear. And as you could guess from my reaction to this, this card was not played at all. It was a very bad legendary when it was released, and it is still a very bad legendary. This is the first weapon that I have played that I thought I was gonna be here for days. Maybe I don't need two Horror Pillagers in hindsight, cause like, I feel like, 
Yeah. All right, I don't know. What's this weapon called? The rune spear. Is the weapon terrible? The weapon is garbage. Like when it was released, it never saw play. Well, you know, uh, that is uh, one of the worst things I've ever seen in my life. So that's a great hand, but at least we have the weapon in hand. Would've been really nice if we could play it for one less mana. This guy kept every card in his hand chat. It's over. Like, I just can see now, or what are, we, what are we saying here? It is what it is, dude. Wow, Frostbite's great. At the moment, looking good. Just like you chat, you guys are looking good today. Every single one of you. I could brilliant macaw this, I guess. That's on board, I guess. Gives me another wind chill to draw another card. I look gross to some of you, and that's okay. Dark skies? Okay. Yeah, it, no, it's okay. He said force them to answer. I also get to do more damage phase, which might be relevant, honestly. Well, here we go. I've never seen this. That's actually go off. I don't think I've ever played it. So uh, here we go. Hey, don't laugh. I just want to see what it does. We're going to need two horde pillagers for sure. Dude. Are you kidding me, bro? I'm playing the rune spear, man. Give me a break, dude. What kind of sociopath does that to someone, dude? All right, definitely not the worst thing. All right, we can go. We can go two things here. I'm going to just coin, I think, for the sake of it. No, I think it's probably OK. What the hell? OK, I'm screwed. Whoa, gamer moment. All right, perfect. This is not pull a beast right Yeah. OK, so we just need to find the weapon. What are we trading here, sir? Yeah, finding a weapon would be insane. OK, that's the weapon. Uh, do I want to play this or not? It'll be a better time for it, I think. So we're going to freeze this, I think. Trade this in. Ooh, Inara, I'm in. This is looking good. We have a must kill unit on the board. We actually get to play it from a seven mana six, six, and we get to swing twice, depending. No, he's going to pull a random beast. Oh, he can't. Oh, but you can't. You're frozen. Wait a minute. We might actually be free from this. Oh my God. Imagine this is it. This is like, it's also 10 damage. Okay. Do I go first or after? That's the question. Right, I get any buff. It's insane. Command, I guess. No, wait, no, no. I don't have rush. Don't concede, please. Weapon didn't earn this win. Are you guys serious? Yeah, you're trolling, right? I feel like that was good enough, was it not? The weapon did six damage. It played com Command the Neptulon, which killed the opponent's board. Because like, unless the weapon spell actually kills the opponent, I don't think it's ever going to be satisfying. For the YouTube video, I got to make sure this is here. You see? We're, we're getting it. All right, we're counting it. I guess I'm going to have to buy more packs because we, we kind of need more packs. For this video, I spent around $150 on packs to get the weapons for this challenge. So I would really appreciate it if you could like the video and comment what you think of it so far. That would be great. All right. Well, I guess the next weapon is the Dragon Soul. This weapon saw virtually no play in standard. It was absolutely horrendous. And I can guarantee you that it sees no play in wild. I thought the last weapon was going to be a big challenge, but I had no idea what I was getting into. I'm just going to I'm just going to concede. We're never going to beat this. I need like an aggressive deck that can't answer my dragons. I got to make the weapon my win condition. I think the way I'm going to win this is just by playing the weapon on three and just hoping that people can't answer it. OK, I'm going to add selflessness in here because I'm going to need it. The other bigger problem with every single weapon going forward is that there is no way in the class to draw a weapon. It was completely based around a random draw or I could use Lowkeeper, Polkelt or a selfless sidekick. But this definitely made the challenge a lot harder. Do this. So we just hope we get the self. Oh, OK, Dave, we're just. Oh, my God, this is going to be so bad. And you have to get lucky. You have to have a good hand for this, man. I would really like this card because it's so good. But um, any weapons? I mean, maybe next time we draw the selfless and I can pop off. It's fun to watch, but I can't imagine how frustrating this. It, it's fine. It is what it is, man. All right, I'm going to move on. It's too late. Only one, though. Dragon Soul, please. I haven't even seen it yet. Oh, this is the dream hand, dude, please. Oh, God, Prince Renathal deck is even worse, but maybe one time. I haven't even seen it. Don't talk to me. Okay, it's not the worst thing in the world. There it is. It's at the bottom of my deck. I have to take it. All right, I'm going to have to get some spells on spells here. <laughs> God, this is so bad, dude. This is so bad. Maybe. Palm reading is really good, but this isn't really the hand I need for it. I wait one turn. I don't know if it's going to be good, but we'll wait one turn. Level Ice Lance. I mean, sure, dude, do you, man? All right, we're going to pop off. Dude, these, this. This draw is atrocious, though. It's so garbage. What am I looking at here? Oh, my God. What is this? I 
I mean, we got dragons, so maybe that's enough. I can't wait to get frozen. It's going to be pretty exciting. If it's ice block, though, I cry, right? What does this deck do? Nothing. It doesn't do anything. Okay, that's actually not the worst thing in the world. Probably need to wait, though. I mean, if it's ice block, it's ice block, chat. Like, I, I don't know what to tell you guys. Hold on. That's actually... No, 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 dude. You can't. You're so gross. I don't need these against this dude. This this is so bad, man. Frost Nova sucked. It sucked big. Okay. I mean, you, legally, you're not allowed to play two encounters, but legally, you're not. If I could pop the block here, I might actually win this. Okay, how do I do this? You're first. Oh, I should have attacked with the one first. It's, is it ice block? Imagine coping thinking it's not ice block. I right, just got to make it as hard as possible to kill. They have a little bit more than, okay, that's that's weak. That's weak. They're down one mana. They're down one mana. They're going to play Varden. They have five mana left because they have a cookie. Don't you freeze my board. You suck. Please, this is it, dude. Please. No, if that's a second block, I'm so, I'm upset. Please stop. Please. Well played. Is it, are you dead? Oh, let's go. Oh my god, I can't believe it. Dude, I'm surprised how well this is going, if I'm being honest. I'm very surprised. I've spent $75 to Blizzard today. Next on the list was the Hunter Legendary Rock Delar. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. Don't get mad at me. Now, this weapon wasn't necessarily bad. It had a place in the Spell Hunter archetype, but there is one issue with this weapon. I can't put minions in my deck with it, which means drawing this weapon became so much harder. The question is, is there anything to draw a weapon? Or are we just going to have to send it every game and just hope we draw it if i draw the weapon and i don't drop block hell that sucks well we'll try our best could have been worse to be honest i full mold this right chat i'm just looking for it I actually didn't okay let's, let's just read this should add starring buzzer and unleash no 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 you don't understand the whole point of this is the spells i need i can't have minions what draws me cards is there any spells there's cards in hunter that draw right like flares one at the quest line from stormwind but you only use it to ping minion until you get the weapon refill worst comes to worst sure yeah we'll do it like that i don't expect this one to be very hard but if we keep drawing like that it's going to be impossible so we'll see so full hun spell hunter without listen i don't have the card i got the weapon I like Tavish a lot, but I mean, drawing cards is good, so we'll get it one day. I just gotta send this. I don't need it. If I ever draw the weapon, it's just free low anyways. Oh my God, bro, just draw the cards. It can't be that hard. Oh my. Mark shot. Yeah, yeah, sorry. That, that's what I needed. Yeah, yeah, Mark shot, Mark shot. I just need more impactful cards, right? The winner prize. All right, the deck got 100% better. Just draw the weapon forehead. It like really doesn't exist, does it? We are sitting here like animals waiting for this thing to show up. And where is it? We'll never know. We have a solution here. It's just be better. The weapon is shy. You need to encourage it to show up. How do I do that? What do I say to the weapon? Here it is. Mwah. Beautiful. I'll keep tracking too. Why not? Hear me out. The weapon carried because it made you build this deck this way. Oh, it's a rogue. All right, I don't want to take damage. We don't have healing. Okay, so we draw a card on four, five, six. We should be able to get some cards out of our hand. Maybe Rock Delar is enough, man. I haven't done any damage to him. I just need to get these cards on my hand. No, I don't need another explosive, you clown. I hope he hits my face. Please hit my face. I heard you like all your expensive cards when you actually end up drawing the weapon because that means you get less stuff. Aha, I'm Hearthstone. I may actually have to wait on this. Okay, I mean, this guy really hit the jackpot if i'm being honest <laughs> i'm reporting you after that joke oh, come on dude stop man i'm just trying to play the game buff my guy okay that looked like it was hot garbage and he may have shadow step i hated that but here we are Ooh, special cutlass is kind of exciting here's the play chat we play this card it gives us a card that kills them is no one gonna mention that weird portal on the left i didn't even see it but yeah you make a good point I didn't even play the weapon. I didn't even play it. I want to scream. It's so annoying. Nice paladin hero power. <gasps> Yo, let's go. I'd rather have more opportunities for spells than worrying about a draw. The grand slam is great. That's good. Okay, this is winnable. All right, I like playing this. I like playing this. I'm definitely playing this. For hero powering. Doing this. And we're going face. It's uh, it's Christmas in July, chat. But here we are. We've been, we've been waiting. We've been suffering for so long. Oh my God. This counts. I don't care what anyone says. This is it. 
In one face, just for funsies. Yes! Solidifies the victory. All right. We then move on to the Warlock Legendary Skull of Minari. And this card saw a ton of play in Standard, and it did see a little bit of play in Wild. So I didn't think that this weapon would take me very long, considering how powerful it was. And I was completely wrong. This was the hardest weapon up until this point. Minari might be a little slow. Maynard, we won with the, the Priest weapon, my dude. You think I'm worried about this one? This is nothing. It's more about drawing Minari, but at least with uh, Warlock, we have Taz. So that was the classic do absolutely nothing for nine turns and just hoping we draw the weapon. And uh, yeah, it doesn't exist. It's not real. It's actually not real. All right, we're making this better. Funny enough, as Warlock, I was having trouble drawing the weapon, so I decided to change the deck a little bit to draw the weapon more consistently. But I was about to see why Skull of Minari does not see play in Wild anymore. Oh my god, there it is in the flesh. Viper incoming. Do not say that. All right, not Malganus. Yeah, let's say it had a void walker oh my god he's this good god we never win at this point right god damn it dude we even draw the weapon here damn i wonder if this dude is playing oh that's not okay oh that's not very nice god i hate priest dude i hate priest dude I, every time i go against it i just have a i remember why i don't like the class dude come on dude. okay it's fine i'm not i'm not This name. If I ever meet this dude in real life, I'm a private pile. You better watch yourself. Why is this so hard? We all expected this to be easier, right? Why? Shut up. I'm so tired of these priests, honestly. I wouldn't think that. Oh my God. Who play? It's the dude. It is 2020. Oh, it's from our new. Oh my God. Shadow madness. Oh my bro. Get me out. I need a non-priest player. Oh, hello, fellow non-priest players. <laughs> Oh, it's a rogue. Oh my God, it's a rogue. Do I coin this out? I, I don't pull a demon. The better play there was not to coin, play this and then go surf and Lee. Can you touch your toes? I think I can. That was bananas. All right, hold on. Let me see if I can touch my toes. Hold on. I'm going to see if I can. Without bending my knees. Is that what you're saying? Is that what we're going for? I can do it. I can do it. Lunch. I got to do this. You try Luke. What? Luke. No, I have not. Thunder, I do not. Once again, I'm getting sapped in 2022. I'm going insane. I'm going insane. The Dragon Soul was easier than this. This has been, I think, the hardest one. We have spent the most time on Skull of Minari, and I never thought in my life I would say that out loud. But again, here we are. I guess I'll put like another Raise Dead. Oh my God, it's in the opening hand. Is this a blessing or a curse, dude? And we got a demon. All right, looking good so far. Oh, it's Pogos. All right, we can beat Pogos. This actually looks like arguably the best case scenario we're going to get. Did they run Vanish in this deck? If they run Vanish, I'm going to be so upset. Okay, uh, that's enough Pogos. Two Dreadlords now. Pull me a Doomguard, please. Dead. So I don't really want to play Carnivious Cube because I would like to get it with the Doom Guard, right? This is a sap. My God, that's a big guy. Uh, this is not, still it's not the worst thing I've ever seen, if I'm being honest. Wait. I still pull a minion right now. We get to pull the Doom Guard next turn guaranteed. I think I want to go face and then Hysteria. This thing. So if it's evasion, it's a little more awkward, but it's not the worst thing in the world. This is going face. What the? F what the hell? I could still get lethal technically. If this card's a Doom Guard off the top, the Doom Guard's edge. Maybe a, maybe a little bit too much pogos here, dude. Okay. Jesus Christ, I didn't expect that to take so long. The next weapon was the Paladin Legendary Valineer. And honestly, I didn't expect this one to be good, but I did not expect it to be nearly as hard as it was. This one by far took the most time and I caught so much footage from this video so you didn't have to sit here for hours. Do not play this weapon in wild. It was not fun whatsoever. I be wrong. I, come to that, like, I have to just be able to draw the weapon though. That's my bigger problem. We'll figure it. I don't know. I honestly have no idea if this is good or not. Well, the weapon at least all right here we go i have to hope that this buffs my uh my samaro if it doesn't buff samaro we're in a little bit of a deep in trouble all right i'm gonna hope for the samaro i think that's my out <laughs> okay i'm gonna hope for samaro <laughs> come on man okay i think i'm dead chat 
Yeah, it's just no way. Okay, there's Leroy. Don't you go on? Actually, I'm gonna play this so it doesn't go on this. Nice. Okay, I'll play it now. It's seven damage. Seven damage, seven damage. Okay. All right, this actually looks pretty good. I played Pull Kelt, so that means we get Cord Pillager on average more often than not. It should be at least. Please don't AFK. Please don't AFK. This is a good, this is really good. Please. Okay, he's, they're healing. They're here, they're here, they're here. Thank you, thank you. Play something, just play it. Year is 2022, and we're literally playing Mass the Spell. We're playing Mass the Spell in the current year. We could still win this. I know. I know we can. Oh my god. We just draw Horde Pillager here and we win the game because of it. Okay. That's not the worst thing I've ever seen. That's fine. I don't know about adding another Nazoth into their deck when they're just going to play it. Thanks for picking the Paladin weapon chat. It's worth the 1600 dust. We're getting a lot of game time out of it. Oh my, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. That's actually not fine because that, wait, how does this work? Does it proc on the weapon? Wait. Oh, it does work. Ew, come on, dude. It's like this game can lick my nutsack. Oh my God, I just want to die. Wait, don't I have a selfless in the deck or is my next card? That It is this go. Oh, okay, hold on. All right, this is actually okay. I'm going to swing at this like an absolute freak. If you could hit one of the doppelgangsters here, that'd be actually the best thing I've ever seen in my life, if I'm being honest. All right, it's a pretty big Leroy though. So we're going to do this. I guess I kill this and then I can do this. Into this. Wait, is this just lethal? Oh my God, hold on. 11 plus 11 plus this is 15. 15 plus. I never thought that was gonna end, dude. I never thought that was gonna end. Thank God. It's done. I never thought that was gonna end, man. That was awful. Our very last weapon was eluded. And this weapon was pretty decent in its time and standard. And quite honestly, I didn't expect this to take that long. It fits into a pretty good burn mage deck in wild. And I had a feeling we were gonna end on a very strong note. Do you really want a recurring game? Yeah, at some point I might need to just use it to draw. Ancient mystery seems great. It curves right into this. Uh, I don't need ignite. Let me come up with these challenges. Uh, I sit in the corner of my room and ask myself, what can I do to torture myself? today. That's where I get those challenges from. I'm really glad we're going against another Thief Rogue, so that's great. The so next turn we go Cabal Lackey into this, I think, and then we can even go Coin into this. That's not bad either. Wow, that was an insane turn. No, I don't think the Witch one one's very interesting because like it's like odd and even. I mean, maybe. I don't know. Do uh, you guys think that'd be fun? Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. We can one shot this. We can one shot this. Oh, my God. I think the Paladin weapon killed me, by the way, chat. I'm just not the same after the Paladin weapon. Barking up the wrong tree, you say. All right, I'm looking for Ignites. And that's it. All right, there we go. All right, so this has to go in the deck. Keep going. Keep it going. Hell yeah. Love cards. Okay, I think this is it, chat. I think we're going to be done after this. I want to hit face. This can go here. We can go face, too, but it's not that big deal. I just want my ignites. Where's my ignites? Yeah, the lowest are going to suck. I'm going to warn you guys. Like, I, I think the most of the lowest will take me about three years to complete. Okay, we're definitely doing this. Okay, I just need to draw one ignite. All right, Sean. I think that's game, chat. I think it's pretty easy to say that uh, Haluneth won me the game. Okay, I'm going to cast. Ice block first, in case it's a counter spell. And we also put him at one with Medivh's valet. I'm guaranteed to draw both ignites with the Lunith. That's this game. Oh, he's dead. Never mind. We're done. I did it. <laughs> yeah, the paladin weapon absolutely killed me. If I'm being honest, I'm not the same. I'm not the same person as I was before the paladin weapon. That was stupid. The hardest part about this was just like drawing the weapon. If you didn't draw the weapon, it's like impossible. Thank you so much for watching this journey of the kobolds and catacombs legendary weapons. If you enjoyed this video and you want to support me, make sure you subscribe, like the video and let me know what you think about the video in the comments down below. And make sure you check me out live on Twitch for our next challenge with the link in the description. Have a nice day.